All right, so it is Friday. Today's America Day, so we got our America gear on. We were just having a good time. Ooh, rain is cold. All right, guys, so nasty storm rolling in. We're closing up shop. Hi guys. Hey everybody. We are in 13 miles. Turn right. In 13 miles, we're going to turn right. We are going to turn right in 13 miles. <laughs> it's Mike and Shelly with Camping with the Confers coming back at you. We are headed back to a campground we've been to before this weekend to meet up with a bunch of new friends. One thing very special about this campground, it is the very first um, video that we ever did for our channel was at this campground. Oh, that's true. Ever? I didn't think about it that way. Yes. Evergreen in Dundee, Ohio. Yeah, we really enjoyed this park last time we were up here. Uh, but yeah, you guys got to stick around with us and check out who we're meeting up with up here this weekend. Yeah. See who you know who this special guest is. The special guest. But it should be a ton of fun. So hang out with us and let's go. All right, so when you get to Evergreen, they give you your car tag, but it's got a key card inside of it. So I already pulled past the key card, so I got to run back here, tap the key card, jump back in the truck, and get through the gate before it closes. So let's see what we can do. Ready? Go. Go. See how long it stays open. We'll make it all the way through. Oh, for sure. Oh, good. I didn't even tell you where you were going. Forward. Speed bump. All right. Here's the map. All right. See where you're at? We came in here. So yep. we went all the way back to the end and then over? Yep. All Pull right. forward a little bit. Back in. Good. Oh, that's us right there. went to check in and nobody's home nobody's home but they did say that supper was here early so they're probably over here at the pavilion so we'll go over there check in and see what we can see yeah there's your sign pick a flag i do have orange if you want orange like that i got it inside i think i know you're gonna say blue here are your there's some giveaways in the pavilion okay so just drop half of them in something that you think you might like. That way I don't have to worry about somebody getting you don't want. Oh, okay. nice. Wow, one. okay. There's a little swag bag. Okay. All right. All right. Here are your little magnetic name tags if you wouldn't mind wearing them just so people on here. That is a great idea. Yeah, it's better than a lanyard. <laughs> it's just, you know, not that. And if you don't have a sharpie in the back of your wig, I have one. Yeah, might as well. And then these are for the camp all day so that and then, do you want tall or short boots? Tall for me. <coughs> uh, tall for me as well. Thank you. Great. And we are, so get yourself together. We're going to, everything's in the pavilion. And then we're going to um, hang out, chit chat. We're going to do the door giveaways tonight so I don't have to worry about them. We've got some music going. We're going to try to do a campfire later on with some s'mores. There you are. Okay. Got all these swag. We got all the swag. We got the flags. We got the sign. We're gonna go grab some supper. Camper crawl sign. Yep. And meet up with everybody. Have some pizza. Salad. Look, looks like you got a nice purse there. You like that? Uh -huh. It's cute. Goes with my eyes. I love that they did name tags. That's super cool. Yeah, I'm the only Mike here. Not really. <laughs> okay, let's go put this stuff away and go Get meet back up with over everybody. There. All right. Whatever you want, dear. These are all the giveaways. And you, and you don't buy tickets for right. the raffle. It, it's just free. Really nice. You know what else? You know what else is free? Wine and beer. So let's go here. What'd you find? Some Dunkin' coffee. You don't need to see what I'm putting in my coffee cup. Just coffee, right? We got beers, we got wine, we got water. Oh, right. wow. Okay. 
everything goes, a girl needs. It goes on and on. All right, just get the line or help yourself. There's 16 pizzas up there. We've got plenty of varieties of pizza, salads, with different salads, different kinds of salads, salad dressing, of course. It's all up there. Have yourself a beverage. Welcome to the first day on the Campbell Hall and Campbell, first day of right? Welcome to Mark. Sure. Sure. Okay. All right. If you would, let's, uh, let's, I can't remember right. Please stand and let's say the Pledge of Allegiance, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Woo. All right, also, let's see, how about all my best police, fire, ambulance people, please stand up and be recognized. So we're leaving the meet and greet. They did a drawing for uh, like tickets for some giveaways. We are walking away with nothing. No winners tonight. So we we're gonna, made, we made friends. We did. They're worth everything. So we're gonna go back and feed the dogs and then come back over. They're having a big group campfire with some s'mores tonight. So we'll bring you guys along with us. So we'll see you in a few. up our first night at the Campaholics meetup. Really good time. We are set up here at Evergreen RV Resort in Dundee, Ohio. We mentioned earlier this is where we did our very first uh, YouTube video so if you want to laugh go check it out. I hope we've improved a little bit since then. I hope so. How you doing Michael? Hello. Good morning. Enjoying Hello. your coffee? It's almost done. So oh. we are in site 44 this weekend. It's, um, it's a nice little site. There's tight side to side, but there's a huge field back behind us. So it makes you feel like you got a little more space. Yeah, let me show you the site. Hold on, guys. Okay, so like I said, this is 44. Stuff right here. There's my Michael. So yeah, so the sites are not, you don't have a lot of space in between, but it's really pretty. We're right across from the volleyball, pool, game room area. There's our campaholic camp out flag next to our camping with the Panthers. Back here. Our fire bowl thing. Oh, we have our lights hung up. Can't see them right now. But then back behind us is this really pretty field. There's a pretty barn way back there. Yeah, so that's what we have here uh, today. I think we're gonna go into town, go to a couple Amish shops, go find some fry pies, because last time we were here, we went to, I think, Amish Baked Door, something like that, and it was really good. So we're gonna check that out again today. And uh, then some activities are planned for the meetup later this afternoon and evening. They are actually providing lunch for us too. And all this, um, was a sponsored event. We didn't have to pay anything additional to our camping fee. And we actually got a discount with our camping fee because we got two discounts, one for Good Sam's and another one for a group discount. So it's been really great. All the people have been really nice. So let's see what today brings. You're going through your swag bag this morning? Mm-hmm. We got this when we checked in. I'm not sure what this is. The game is make up what it's used for. I'm gonna okay. say it's a luggage bag. I'm gonna call it a shoe can holder. Oh, it could be transparent. Like it's round, right? So that way you know what flavor you have, right. and then you could flip it to your pants, so that way you don't get that circle in your pocket. See? That I hate. Okay. This 
is a this is I think it's a fan. Oh. Are you making that up though? Yeah. But that's pretty good. You got Koozie. Two koozies and they even ask, do you want tall ones or short ones? Oh, these are those reusable Ziploc bags. Nice. How fun is that? Yeah. We've got, wait for it, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a chapstick. It says it's a cube lip moisturizer. Okay. You know how I feel about my chapstick. Oh, my goodness, twist. Wait, there's more. Hand sanitizer, a bunch of mints, and Duro sticker. Your banner. Campaholic sticker. The Honor Network sticker. Nice. I really want to support these people. I'll be doing that. This is recorded. That way it's a accountability for me to not forget. I believe what they're doing. More Enduro stuff. Open Road sticker. Lippert sticker. Lippert Scout. I want to look that up too. Yeah, we ought to get into that. You join the Lifford Scouts and then they have like meetups all over the country. All right, good Friday morning, everybody. So we are walking around over here at Evergreen. Uh, supposedly, it's only like a five minute walk over to the little shop called the Red the, Tomato. The Red Tomato. Yeah, it's like a farm market. Place. So we're going to walk over there this morning and see if we can find some produce. And, and I'm some steps in. That's what I'm trying to do. She's getting steps in. I'm looking to cheat on my diet because last time we were up here, I had an apple fritter the size of my head, and it was the best apple fritter I'd ever eaten in my life. So if I can find one of those again, I'm cheating. So he's gonna pay the consequences. She's All right. So we made the long walk. Not really. It's like five minutes, but we've made brisk. it to brisk five minutes. Brisk five minutes. Oh, look, he's in the horse. So, yep, he's just hanging out. I know, you don't always see a place that has a out there. The red tomato. So, let's go check out this spot here. And hopefully we don't buy too much, because I'm going to have to carry it while we walk all the way back. I've got my mule pack. Is that what it's called? Pack mule? A pack mule? Yeah, mm -hmm. thanks. I'll be your Sherpa today. seen such a thing. <laughs> I was today years old. Tell me about that apple fur. It's really good. Are you happy? I am happy. You have a look of guilt on your face. I'm not guilty. I don't feel guilty yet. We'll see what happens, but it's worth every bite right now. Are there like chunks of apples and stuff? Because I know that you're particular about that. Yes, there is. It's okay. Delicious. Good. I got a maple cream filled it's pretty good not the best i've ever had but i don't think it's fresh that's my concern mm. all right let's walk back walking all right so it is friday today's america day so we got our america gear on uh we're headed over to the pavilion have a little bit of lunch yeah they're providing lunch um for free but it's not gluten free so michael has a that was salad and it's America Day. So that's why he's got that. And my shorts. And that. And the I Jelly have has got on. this lovely dress and it has pockets, but I just can't show you right now. Okay, so, so we're gonna go chit some, chat. Get some lunch and then we'll get back to setting up. Oh yeah, for tonight. Right. Stay tuned for that surprise. All right guys, so the campsite's starting to come together for the camper crawl. Got some of the decorations out. The backdrop, we're fighting the wind with it. There's some lays. Got the palm trees up. We got the flowers up around the campsite for the lights. 
Now all we got to do is cook and get the food and drinks ready. And we'll be ready for our camper crawl here with the Campaholics. What do you think, Mama? Woo-hoo! Gonna be a good night? Be a great night. All right, let's get started. There's no competition to this, so all the pressure's off. Right. Chef Michael, I feel like I gotta come up with some other name with that bandana on your head and those flag shorts. Instead of Captain America, I can be Chef America. Okay, there you go. Starting the appetizer for the camper crawl. Mm -hmm. We are going to be making... I have no idea. I'm just making okay. chicken. Tell them, it's pineapple barbecue chicken to go with our Hawaiian tropical theme. Yes? Yes, that's what it is, what she said. What I say always goes. Right. Yes. All right, guys, the rain has finally ended. We're headed over to start the camper crawl. So we're gonna bring you guys along with us. I think there's only five stops on this one, right? Five stops, but there are 60 people. So all 60 people are going to the five spots. Should be an event. You have to have your VIP wristband. Yeah. All right, so let's go up here and check in. Let's see if Michael has to crawl to the last stop. Get it started. He's already got a head start. Today. Whatever. It's five o'clock somewhere. Yeah, it's five fifty-four. See, I'm All right. fine. All right. Let's go see what everyone else is doing. We'll be back. They're ready. <laughs> Stop number one. <laughs> All right. All right, Joe. What are we having? We got cranberry meatballs that I've never tried before, and uh, cream sickles made with moonshine and uh, whipped cream vodka. All right. And orange juice. Okay, try it. Thank you, thank Cheers. you. Cheers. Thanks guys for hosting. to the next stop. Hello, hello. What do we have at this one? Bourbon coolers. Bourbon coolers. Bourbon You're gonna post the uh, I will. ingredients? All right, yes, sir. Guys, check us out. Alright, will do. And you are camping with the conference. Camping with the conference, that's right. What do we got going on here, guys? We have some sangria. Okay. And then charcuterie boards that are not on a board. Charcuterie cups. Charcuterie cups. cups. Alright. Margarita Pops. Margarita Pops. Pops. Yeah. Yummy. Yeah. Lovely. Approved. 
guacamole and salsa. All right, come on in. Nice. We had, we had the taste tester. There you go. Now you gotta talk like a wrestler. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. All right. All right. What's the drink of choice here tonight? Flaming Orchard, uh, Fireball, Orange Juice, and Peach Stop. totally didn't document all that business. What just went down? That storm came on like it was nobody's business. It's like raining like crazy out there. I kind of got everything pulled in. We were just having a good time. Oh, that rain is cold. All right guys, so Shelly Kay went and got herself in trouble down here at the courthouse to pay her bail and then I gotta go next door here to the law offices to get her out so stick around with me and I'll show you what she got herself into as soon as I get over here next door to the to the law office <laughs> now really we are in Dundee Ohio we're down here at the Amish door bakery they got these little makeshift building set up so. Here's the, here's the law offices here. She's gonna go get her attorney. So I'm gonna go get something fresh baked and bad for me. That right there, it's gonna be in my belly. Michael, did you say that there's also a restaurant here? I did not. Oh, there okay. Is. So, the Amish store bakery where we're getting donuts, um, there's also a restaurant. We've not eaten there, but I'm sure it's delicious. And then, uh, oh, because it's Amish door village is what this is called, which is why they had all those little buildings and stuff. And then there's also the market. So we're gonna go check that out. Oh, look, see how happy he is. That's one good apple fritter right there. All right, guys, so nasty storm rolling in. We're closing up shop. Get the slide in, just try to save on some leaks just in a case case. Bring in that center of gravity. So Head we got shelter, tornado warnings, yeah. hail. Yeah, they said quarter size hail, 60 mile an hour winds. But we'll see what we get. Looks like somebody's either just getting here or pulling They're out. Leaving. Too, so. I don't blame them. All right. Quit. Let's go. Yeah, so we're headed over to the office. They've got a basement. They said to get over there with a quickness. And here comes the rain, so let's step it up. I don't get tornadoes where I come from. <laughs> yeah, well, where are you from? The Tennessee. tornadoes, yeah, right? Corner. There in that red blip. Yeah, I know. We're up we, here on the blue dots. Mornings, so I think it's going to go south of us. We but we've seen them turn before, so it's better to be safe. So this is our shelter space. It's nice that they provide this, though. All right, so we missed the first round. It stayed just south of us, the tornado that was uh, on the ground. So we've survived the first round. There is a second round coming back up north of us here. So we'll see if it uh, stays up there, if it decides to turn and come down here. So the thunder's still a rolling. We got a little bit of breeze, but nothing too bad. So um, we'll see how it goes. We'll let you know. All right, so the storm is officially over. I mean, you can see it looks nasty back behind us, but that's what went through already. So we're headed back over to the camper. They do say there is another storm coming, but... It looks like it's gonna stay north of us though. Let's hope. So we're gonna go over and get ready for the potluck. Mm -hmm. Get our side dish put together and come back over for the party. We'll bring you with us. Hey there, good looking. How you doing? Oh, we better step up the pace. Set aside also for us. If you want to come in on the 14th and enjoy one extra night, that's fine. Saturday night. 
coming on. Saturday night, here they're having a corn festival, coming, coming corn off. harvest festival, whatever. Right here in this pavilion next year. So they're putting corn on the grill, buying mm -hmm. all the food. In the after trailer park party, playing some games. Playing some games. Rolling the bones. Steve, you are the biggest recruiter to Alright, guys, so one last morning breakfast here. Frying up some hash browns. I made some sausage gravy. I'm gonna go meet up with some friends who are making the biscuits and eggs. And, uh, have a little breakfast this morning before we pack up and take off to head back to uh, our home base. Yeah, I will too. Yeah, we gotta run over to our So a little recap of the weekend. Oh, wow. I'll tell you what, we've been to some rallies, we've been to some meetups, whatever they're called. This one, I've got to say, was really well put together. Um, the Campaholics were my, great. Yep. Definitely felt like a community. We went there, never met anybody. We were completely strangers and a lot of the people did know each other. There was a rally last week for um, the Ohio Grand Design Rally. We weren't able to go to that rally, but a lot of the people that were at this week's rally were at that rally, and then they're also all going to the national rally coming up. Um, they had all had the opportunity to kind of meet and you know, get to know one another. But I did not feel like an outsider. Not at all. Uh, again, when you just gather with those like-minded people that have, um, you know, a little RV lifestyle, whether it's, you know, full-time, part-time. Yeah, it was really well ran, well organized. It wasn't super busy to where, you know, you felt like you had to be in an event every hour of the day. Yeah, so it gave you free time to just go and explore the area. That was really nice, too. And Evergreen is a really nice park. I guess my my plug for this is um, find a rally to attend or a meetup to attend. They're really fun. Yeah, and they will be having another one next year. So um, if you guys follow the Campaholics, I think they're mostly on Facebook. They're supposed to be releasing the dates for next year's. Yeah, like in about a month. Soon. Yeah. yeah. We got strongly recommend if you're in the area. Trying to make that one, it's, it's a really good event. Yeah, or something else that's you know in your area. So we were surprised how many people were there from. We met people from North Carolina, from Massachusetts, from Pennsylvania, from Michigan, Tennessee, West Virginia, Indiana. I mean, I was really surprised. There really weren't that many people from. Ohio. Ohio, yeah, and one of the other, the, I think maybe the other Ohio couple that we met, um, they actually live not too far from Dillon State Park, so we're going to make Joe plans and to meet up with them. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, um, we were actually camped next to a channel, they don't have a YouTube channel, but they have an Instagram um, account, RV Life of Riley. Riley. So check them out, I'll actually link them too. There were a few other channels that were there. We'll 
link them also down in the description box. So you guys go check them out. Everybody, like like Shelly said, everybody that we talked to and met this weekend were great. Yeah, and uh, be sure to check out Mike and Missy's Campaholics channel and become a Right. Like we already are. Okay, guys, so keep your adventures going. And we will see you next week. Bye, guys. See ya.